All right, guys, I came over to do a little inspection of the wing. Everything appears to be okay. The leading edge and everything is... I felt no soft spots in it at all. I did find a few things that's going to have to be addressed before before we put it back in the air. Hang on a second. I like back. That's all the water that came out of that wing. Sickening. Anyway, a common problem that was addressed later on in the years is you can see how that trailing edge, upper trailing edge, has pulled loose. Let me see if I can show you here. See how that's, and the fix to that is putting doublers on each side of that gusset and then clamping that down and then re all of it together and that, that holds it down. As you can see, the bottom ones are fine, but pretty much every one across the top and then also, this is the center attachment point for the aileron. The aileron rides in here and it, it pivots right there in that little slot. And you can see that's came loose. So, nothing but a filling that cavity full of epoxy and clamping that back down and holding it in place and maybe putting a doubler on it as well so anyway it's uh i've got to eventually get back over here and probably cut cut a hole right here this is covered up by the wing tip that so can't see it anyway but probably going to cut a hole right here so I can run that snake in there and then one back here where I can get on in between the front spar and the rear spar which the front spar is here and the rear spar is right in here somewhere so I've got to be able to get on both sides of this spar and run a sea snake in there to see so I can see exactly what if any damage has occurred so there you go.